Hello there, welcome everybody. Today we're going to be playing Astroneer. Astroneer is in pre-alpha. Uh, what it basically is, uh, you land on a planet and you've got to build a base and you can also just fly onto other planets. Um, people are saying it's what No Man's Sky would have been. Uh, I've played it a tiny bit. So far it's so good, apart from sometimes it seems a little bit limited and what you can do, but that's sort of what you can expect from a pre-alpha game. So to start off with, you sort of spawn here on this little planet and you've got to farm your resources. So all around you find different resources like over here. This is... No idea until I... I think this is, co yeah, this is compound. So the, I think these are infinite resources here. Um, so one of the main key issues is power. I haven't sort of explored too far in here, so that's why I'm doing this series. Just to basically see what you can do on Astroneer. And if anyone's thinking about buying it or supporting it, then hopefully this will help you make up your mind. Um, so, first thing is, I think I need some resin to actually be able to expand my base. Um, I think these are things that these are things that land on the planets and sort of there's some goodies in them, uh, sort of like metals and that kind of stuff. There we go. I think this is silicon here. Of oh, resin, sorry. Yeah. So sort of speaking, we've just got my uh, resin and <laughs> it's holes in that. Are, oh, I'm gonna die. I am running out of oxygen. It may be a good idea to build some tethers. Quick, 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 quick. That was close. Right, anyway, I should be able to add something onto here. I've noticed a glitch with this game is if you uh, start building here too early, you actually can't expand from here. So it's always good to build out if you can as soon as possible. So, anyway, we need to build some. Tethers, there we are. Alright. So have we got some of these, hopefully. We can go a little bit further without running out of oxygen. Just where was I? I had some oh, I was here on the yeah, that's right. So sort of as you go on you're gonna sort of need power and Alright. Oh, there's some more over here anyway. Oh, I think, yeah, we've got a cave system here as well, which is quite good. So we've actually uh, spawned on quite a good planet. I'll oh, just collect this resin up anyway. It's quite ugly with all these holes that you find. Dotted around the planet. Uh, you can fill them back in, but... Of course, if you watch... Oh, it uses up a lot of power and at this stage. Don't really have that power to spare. Alright, so anyway, I'm going to go carry on expanding the base slightly. So now we've got these tethers set up, it also gives us a direction to be able to get back here. Right, just want to expand out here. And then I also want to expand out here. How much resin do I have? Don't have enough now. But we've sort of got the outline of our base set up this side now. So we can build three modules on here. Let's see if this is infinite. Yeah, we seem to be getting uh, a little bit more from that now. So it seems that that does spawn. Just need to go get some more resin. So I can carry on building the base. There's quite a bit around here anyway, so we're quite lucky. Some uh, spawns, you don't actually get a lot of this around. You've actively got to go out and uh, search for it. There we are. It's starting to become night time now. So anyway, we'll go take these back to the base. <laughs> Keeping our oxygen as we do. But I, I find the graphics in this game really nice, pleasant. Look at you've got the planets going by. Uh, you've got the sort of nice sunrise. It's very cartoony, but uh, I think. That was broken. Oh, there we are. That was close. Almost glitched out the game. 
So one of the first things that we should really build is a research bay. So I think those things up there we're able to research on here. But of course, to do that, we need power. I think this is a power source over here. So we are quite lucky in the fact we've got these infinite sources around. Let's just collect all this up. Alright, let's run back to the base. Quick, quick, quick. So as you can see, there's um, also displays where your home is. Don't think it does it if you go too far away though. Kind of loses where you are. Right, now that's filling up with power. One of the biggest things to get used to in this game is the controls. Oh, I don't know what that is up there. Oh, it's... We can research. Right, let's go research. I wonder what we've got. Right, chuck that on there. What's it gonna be? See, we can get sort of vehicle mods, um, new solar panels, I think, and stuff like that. I haven't really played it too much to know what we get. What we got here? Fuel condenser. I'm guessing that makes us fuel um, for when we've got our rocket to be able to fill it up and everything. Don't take my word on it at this stage yet. Right, let's go take this back here. Chuck that on here. We got enough power? No, we don't. That's what power's one of the biggest issues right at the start. Because as you can see, that just used up all the power I just got. Um, you do find power dotted around the map and just got nowhere to look. What we got over here? Some more resin, might as well take that. I haven't encountered any mobs or anything on this game yet. I'm guessing they'll be adding it in the future. I wish that, that I don't think there's farming. I, there is organic materials about this. I don't really know what I'm meant to do with them. I don't know if that's in the game or they're just going to be adding it at a later date. Alright, got some resin. So I might as well just build another compartment on here. So as you see now I've built that, you can't actually extend onto it anymore. Um smelter's another good one to have. Of course we need some compound for that. That's so when we go mining and things like that we'll find ore, but we've actually got to smelt it up with power to Alright. I'm just gonna run back now. Because there was a mine over here from what I can remember. It was tear on it. Oh, uh, that was annoying there. Place these down as you go. Oh, I think I've run out. I forgot. Can I build any? Yeah, no, any compound which is here anyway. It takes a while to sort of know what you need. All right, I can build some now. <laughs> There we go. Should be able to we'll venture forth into this cave now. Wish me luck. See, I suppose that's sort of a glitch at the moment. Is it uses the closest tether, which kind of looks a bit ugly or annoying, as such. All right. It's quite a deep cave. This. Oh, it's gas coming towards me. Oh, this is, okay, maybe. Does that kill me? Yeah, it looks like they're trying to kill me. Because it seems to be Chase. Can I kill him? Oh, I thought it didn't seem. Have I killed them? Okay, they're not spitting gas anymore. Maybe they can kill you? This is power here anyway, so we might as well that up. That was a bit weird. I think maybe they can kill you. That's some f fuel there, so I suppose we'd do that with the smell tree or something. Some more of those. Oh, 
horrible things. Let's run out of tethers again. Let's go get some more compound, I think. Alright, let's go for a run back up here anyway. See, these, these tethers, I don't really like the look of them. But, not much we can do about it. Oh, there's compound here anyway. I forgot about that. Seems quite a bit of compound around. What was it that I needed to um, build that bay? Was it compound? I think it was. Have I got enough anyway? Yeah, I will have enough to be able to go back and check. Right, let's have a run back up here. Uh, yeah, it needs two compounds for the smelter. Let's chop those on. I need some power for here as well, didn't I, to research that one. So we chuck some power on. Just watch how quickly this goes down though as well. Yeah, it, once you've got a printer you can start printing some solar panels and everything to actually generate your power. Alright, I wonder what this one's going to be. I think useful, please. Dynamite. That's a new thing they've added I saw in their new update. Allows you to blow things up. I suppose it's just for the fun of it. I need some... I think it's resin, isn't it, to build more tethers. Just so I can go deeper into the cave. There we go. I'll be able to build some now. Yes. Sword. Oops. Right, I'll be able to go a bit deeper now. <laughs> I can remember the entrance. See, I'm not sure, but when you've got power at your base as well, I don't have any power in your pack. I'm not sure if this sucks power out from your base. Because it does look a little bit weird. I think we're going to take it. Can we go down deeper? We can. Take a different. Oh, I'm sliding. I'll just stop sliding. That was quite scary. This cave is deep. If there's, if there's nothing down here, I'll be annoyed. Alright, I'll suck. This is oxygen up anyway. This cave does go really deep. And I'm out of tethers again, so I hope that. Okay, so I'm going to have to come back to that. I'm going to have to go get some more tethers to be able to go deeper. Um, so in the next episode, I will go build some more tethers and I'll come back down here. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.